reviewing and organizing in PowerPoint. Lofty goal. In this lesson, you will learn about the following. Viewing slides, normal view, slide sort of view, slideshow view, organizing slides. In the classroom, my teachers showed a presentation in different views. Why do we need different views? If you use your slides to talk to an audience, you need to view the slides in slideshow view. Slides in a PowerPoint presentation can be viewed in a variety of ways depending on the task at hand. It is important that you are able to access the different PowerPoint slide views and use them for various tasks. Three of the four views are visible from the default view, normal. The slide view commands are located at the bottom right side of the PowerPoint window in the normal view. To access all the different slide views, click on the view ribbon at the top of the screen. On the left end of the view tab of the ribbon, you will see the different choices of views. Normal view, slide sort of view, notes page view, slideshow view. Viewing slides, normal view. This view is where you create and edit your slides. You can also move the slides in the Slides tab, Task, Pane on the left. Slide Sort of View This view shows miniature versions of all the slides in horizontal rows. These miniature versions of the slides are called thumbnails. Slides can be easily deleted and quickly rearranged in this view. Effects such as transitions and sounds can be added to several slides at the same time in this view. Slide Show View This view fills the computer screen with the slide and is what the audience will see when they view the presentation. The Slide Show View has an additional menu that allows you to navigate through the slides as well as other features that you can use during a presentation. Some more. Use the arrow keys page up and page down keys, space bar and enter key to move through the slides in slideshow view. Hots. What will you do to end a slideshow? Slideshow menu. When you are in slideshow view, the following buttons and menus appears on the left side of slide. Arrows. The forward arrow displays the next slide and the back arrow displays the previous slide. Menu icon. Click the menu icon and a menu appears which gives you the option to move to the next or previous slide, jump to a specific slide, change your screen options or end the show. Pen icon. Click the pen icon and a menu appears that allows you to change your cursor to a ballpoint pen, a felt tip pen or a highlighter and choose the color of the pen. This allows you to annotate your slides and make notes while you present to an audience. Organizing slide. It is possible to delete slides in normal view by selecting them in the slides panel and clicking on the delete key on your keyboard. However, it is more convenient to organize the slides in the slide sort of view. Deleting slides. Step 1. Click on the view tab. Step 2. Click the slide sort of view. Step 3. Click to select the slide that you want to delete. Step 4. Use the delete key on your keyboard to delete the selected slides. Changing the order of slides. Step 1. With your presentation, the slide sort of views, click on the slide that you want to move. This will select the slide but not move it. Step 2. Hold down the mouse button and drag the slide to the place where you want it. Step 3. When you see a vertical line where you want to slide to be, Release the mouse button and your slide will be moved to the new location. Step 4. Keep on moving the slides around within the presentation until they are in the desired order. Inserting a new slide. Step 1. With your presentation in slide sort of view, click on the location in the presentation where you would like the new slide to be located. Step 2. Click on the home tab. Step 3. Click on the new slide button. A new slide will be inserted in your presentation. Inserted new slide. Which one is correct? 